The Philippine government loses yet again a batch of cases involving Marcos ill gotten wealth. The Supreme Court's Third Division junked six civil suits against the late Marcos crony Eduardo Danding Huanco, saying the Coco Levy cases took too long in court. The ruling was made on April 21, but the decision was uploaded only on November 11. The High Court also bars the Antigraft Court Sandigan Bayan from taking any further action on the 32-year-old case, saying the respondent's constitutional right to a speedy trial has already been violated. The cases involved taxes paid by coconut farmers that enabled Kohuanko and other cronies to amass roughly 8 billion pesos in ill-gotten wealth with the help of the late dictator Ferdinand Marcos. The case was filed in 1987, and in 1999, the Sandigan Bayan divided it into eight suits. Two of these were resolved since, and the remaining six never reached trial. In the years since, the Sandigan Bayan had been denying motions to render judgment and rejected Kowanko's motion to put the cases on calendar. This prompted Kowanko to go to the Supreme Court in July 2019 to invoke his right to a speedy trial. Kowanko died at the age of 85 in July 2020. The Presidential Commission on Good Government reasons the delay was due to the complexity of issues, voluminous records, extraordinary number of parties, and the practice of frequently resorting to reviews of orders or resolutions.